We will be making gulach today. Gulach is known to be the most popular dish during the Ramadan month. The milk used in this dessert is the most essential part of it. It doesn't make a difference whether it's fresh or long-life milk. The most important step is to make sure it's lukewarm for this recipe. I am pouring 200 ml of granulated sugar into a liter of lukewarm milk. If you're using fresh milk, then you can bring it to a boil and leave it to cool down until it reaches a lukewarm temperature. For shelf-stable milk, it will be sufficient to bring it up to a warm temperature. First of all, let's take a ladleful of the milk and pour it into a baking tray. You do not have to have a round tray for this, as you can cut the gulat sheets to size and shape. Gulat sheets are basically starch wafers which are made of flour, cornstarch and water. After placing a layer of these sheets, pour another ladle full of the milk over it. Let's now add another layer of it. If the tray you have is a perfect fit for the uncut gulat sheets, then you wouldn't have to cut them. The package we bought had 10 of these sheets in it. Therefore, after the fifth layer, I am sprinkling crushed walnuts. I am repeating the same steps for the second half of the sheets. I am now pouring in the remaining milk over the tray. Let's now spruce it up with some fruits. You can use any fruit you would like. We are using strawberries, kiwis and some orange peel for this. After this step, it needs to rest for half an hour more to absorb the milk. Then it will be ready to eat. Enjoy and please do not forget to like and share our videos.